Hello everybody and welcome to President Evil Outbreak. Yep. So I'm just gonna be playing through the scenarios, see how far I get on the hardest difficulty possible. Now as you can probably tell I have played this before. I did do a test recording on the first scenario. Didn't turn out as much as as well as I wanted it to, so I'm gonna be redoing it again. Uh, let me see. Can't remember what character I played last time. Yeah, I played Mark, that's it. I played Mark last time. So I think I'm going to be playing as... Uh, let's go with... Oh no, David. <laughs> playing it on normal. That's the hardest difficulty I can play at the moment. There was a disruption earlier at today's football match between the Raccoon Sharks and the Old Court Thunders. Apparently the game was interrupted when an unruly fan got out of control and sparked a rush. The number of injuries not yet known. Huh? Oh. 
find you eating anything. Hey, Bob, where's your mind at? What? Okay, right, must admit, people in that pub are really hostile towards people who just walk in. So who is this guy? Oh, wrong one. I noticed that the introduction there was a little different than when I played as Mark. For instance, the bartender had a bit more to say after he closed the door. But anyway, let's push these barrels there. Uh, the thing that I like about David is he has a tool belt and he has some melee weapons and that's pretty easy to use. Pretty handy as well if you don't have a weapon, or you run out of ammunition. Right. I haven't played this game in so long. Not since I was just a, a wee little lad. It's been forever. I think I have some really good memories this game, really good memories. So I'll have a small foldable knife, jump parts, yeah I can repair um, broken weapons and that. But we'll just equip the handgun for now. I think I'm going to be recording these in like batches of 15 minutes, so it's not too long. I'll take this. I'm not going to bother, should I bother with Bob? Yeah, I'll bother with him. But I'll leave him here for now, I'm going to check out the bathrooms first. Should be something good enough. Seems I can get out through what? I didn't check that out. Uh, no, I don't want to read the plane manual. I don't think there's any f special items over there, is there? No. I might have to check the... What's it? The menu, the board in, near the door. I might have to check that out. I think there's a blue item there. I might have to check that out. That's a broom if I remember. Yep, I'm not interested in that. Here, let me hit you. Oh, thank you very much, Kevin. Yeah, who do we have? We have Kevin and... Do we have Cindy with us? The usual two? Jay's Bar. Why do you have a quote Jay's Bar? It's my bar. Oh, we have Mark. Didn't think we would have Mark and Kevin on the same team. Oh, <laughs> that impact sound. would have handled that situation slightly differently. For instance, I wouldn't have been sitting there. I would have been out the, I would have been at the back door by now. I don't think anyone in their right mind would just sit there. Um, you're going here. Now, the question is, should I get the blue item on the menu near the door? Green herb. Uh, I don't know. I don't really need it. What's the what's the commands? Uh, you don't need a handgun. You could have. 
Yeah, go ahead, you can have this. I don't really even want it, I'll need it. And I'll take the herb. Kevin, take this. Yeah, that's a good lad. So now he actually has a gun. Even though Kevin does have a gun by default, but his gun is a special weapon and it requires special ammunition that is not used in normal handguns. And that ammunition is very rare to come by. Oh boy. Nope, get off! Get off! Today's special, there's nothing now. I swear there was a thing there. Come on, mate, let's get you out of it. I don't care, Kevin, you can handle it. Right, uh, wrong button. Uh, these controls. I'm on caution already. I don't think I would be on caution already. Damn. Did not think I'd be on caution already. That is bad. After one hit, this is going to be difficult. And to think that there's like two more difficulties after this is hard and it's very hard. And if I remember correctly, I've played them on both difficulties. It is quite painful. Herb. I'll take that. It might just be worth me using one. Just to get myself off caution. Come on, Bobby. Staff room. The first time I recorded this, I was stuck trying to find the key to go upstairs for ages. I was literally stuck for like five, ten minutes. So I hope now that I know what to look for, where to look for it, oh, I won't be that long. Probably try and get up to the roof now. The break room. Alright, uh, oh map, thank you. Oh, help, help. Yeah. Stop hugging him. Oh yeah, I forgot. David also holds his weapon differently to most of the, to all of the characters actually. Go away! Go away! Go away! Uh, no. <laughs> yeah, get him. Okay, right. He's dealt with. I don't know the the uh, button, the hotkey, for reloading. I only know how to do it for the main menu. Mostly because I've been playing Resident Evil 2 lately. That game is absolutely fantastic. Hopefully Bob came through. He should come through. I thought I'd have to go back and get him. I don't know how the mechanic with Bob actually works out. Oh no, he's here. That's good. Come on. Yeah. You gotta love these old Capcom games, the subtitles do not match the character's speech in any way. Who took the nail gun? Eh, I was gonna do the door, but nah, doesn't matter. Right, time to pick up the key. Uh, yep, there it is, special item. There's a red up here, and I could use that. Oh, whoops. Misclick. Yes. That would be handy. That will come in handy. Uh, pesticide spray. Not needed. Nothing in there that I don't want. Whoops. That was an accident. Why I've got a gun equipped? Go away. Die! Fine, whatever. Oh, these herbs. Someone pick up the herbs. Oh, there's nothing else in that room that we need. You can get a revolver in there, but you have to go up to the where all the 
alcohol bottles are and take one back down here and put it in the wall. If I remember correctly. Alright. Drawing room. I think I'm going to end it in here actually for the first part. See how things go. Right, well. That's 15 minutes, just over actually. But anyway, that's the first part of Resident Evil Outbreak, file 1. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know what you think. Let me know how I can improve. And uh, see you in the next one.